Hey guys, so today I have here my new digital picture frame. That is here the C10W picture frame from Mavu. This picture frame has a 10.1 inch diameter and it is not just like any other digital picture frame. This one is actually Wi-Fi enabled and it allows you as well as your friends to send pictures right to the frame through the internet. This digital picture frame comes of course with an instruction manual, then also a microfiber towel and also here this little side stand. And then of course a power supply. This is a 5 volt power supply and it is connected by this little tiny barrel connector. But now let's have a look at the picture frame itself. And as I said before, this picture frame has a screen size of 10.1 inches. And it comes with this protective foil on the front, which we can peel off later. And written on there are the initial instructions on how to get started with this digital picture frame. It starts out with the Wi-Fi connectivity, then the naming of the picture frame, and then also how to install the app on our smartphone, which allows us to send pictures directly to the picture frame. But before we get to that, let us have a look at the back side. Here we find two locations that allow us to hang the picture frame on the wall. And we can do this horizontally or vertically. Then this tiny hole on the bottom, that is for a Kensington lock. So we can secure the picture frame someplace. And then we also have the option to use this tiny leg here. That allows us to place the picture frame on a desk or in a shelf, for example. We find the connections to the device in this little cutout here on the left side. It starts out with a tiny reset button, then a USB or micro USB port. Here's a micro SD card slot. And then on the right side is the connector for the power cable. And then here on the top we find the on and off button. So now it is time to start up the device for the very first time. All we have to do is plug in here the power connector on the back side and it automatically starts the booting sequence. From the first look of it, it appears that this picture frame is using the Android operating system. And I believe this makes this device really easy to use because you kind of already know how to operate the menus from your smartphone. The booting process takes about a minute to complete and afterwards it is taking us automatically into the initial setup wizard. Here we are going to set the language, connect to our Wi-Fi network, set the time zone and also check for new software updates. Then next we're going to give our picture frame a name and a location. This is really useful if we want to allow our family and friends to send pictures directly to our picture frame or in case we do own multiple devices. Next I'm going to continue on my smartphone and first I'm going to install here the Framio app and this is available for Android as well as iPhones. In order to connect the app to our picture frame we're going to click here on add friend and that gives us a unique 10 digit code which we can either use for our own smartphone or we can also give it to our family and friends in order to connect to our picture frame. So I'm going to type this code here into my app and afterwards we're going to immediately see in confirmation on the screen of the picture frame that this new friend, which was ourself in this case, was successfully added to the frame. So now let us try out and see if this really works. So I'm going to take a picture here with my smartphone and I am selecting it to be sent here to Mega Safety First Office. So I selected the picture frame and then here I can even add a little note to give myself some information with this picture here. But you're not just limited to photos in this case, you can even send videos and they are going to be played on the screen of the picture frame. And this jingle that we just heard, that is the indication that we just received a new photo. So now we see the photo that we just had on our smartphone is now already inside of the picture frame and it's going to be part of the rotation of all the pictures that are on this frame. And it's a little bit hard to see in the video here, but on the lower left corner, that's where we have this little pop-up and that's where we can read the message that we put into our smartphone when we were sending this picture over. Now the storage space is over 16 gigabytes, so there's plenty of space for tens of thousands of pictures. And uploading them over the internet is not just the only option to add pictures here. We can also copy our pictures on a small micro SD card and then just insert it on the back of the picture frame and then import them into the picture frame from there. 
Now, in case you have received pictures from your family or friends and you want to save those pictures on your computer, for example, then there's also an option to export those pictures to the SD card and then from there you can copy it to your computer. Okay, so now I have already a couple of pictures on the device and with a simple finger swipe we can scroll through all the pictures or we can just enable the slideshow functions and then the photos are going to alternate in the customizable time interval. Okay, so this was already it for this video. I am really excited about my new digital picture frame here. And if you have any more questions or comments, then please write a message below.